we're here at the Henry's Photographic Video and Digital Imaging Show. Uh, I'm here talking to Ian Ray from Pocket Wizard. Uh, we just wanted to talk a little bit about the uh, Nikon Pocket Wizards, the TTL control ones. Uh, so, Ian, what took so long? Uh, what took so long? Uh, we've been working very hard on getting the firmware development ready. Uh, the hardware is essentially ready to go. Um, we're going to start production pretty soon. And uh, currently we're targeting a late fall release of the radios. Um, so we're hoping to make uh, the Christmas season pretty happy for a lot of people, for a lot of Nikon shooters. I know it's definitely going to make a lot of Nikon shooters very happy. Yep. Uh, can you show us a little bit about the, uh, the, the AC3? And here we have the TT, uh, TT1. Absolutely. We've got a mini TT1 for Nikon. Uh, and we've got an AC3 Nikon dedicated as well on camera. Uh, the mini TT1 is our transmit unit, which transmits to our receiving uh, flex TT5 units, which can also do transmit functionality as well. The AC3 on top allows you to control three remote zones, uh, and that gives you control both in manual and TTL functions. Uh, from there, uh, the flex TT5 can also be used on camera as a transmitter as well, and can be used to trigger the camera remotely, and fire remote flashes from that remote camera. Okay. And what kind of range are we looking at with the TTL functionality? Uh, in full TTL mode, you're probably looking at about uh, 800 to 900 feet. Um, if you put it into basic trigger mode, where it's just going to fire, uh, you probably get about 12 to 1500 feet. Okay. Um, it does depend on your environment and you know, the radio stuff in the area, but uh, that's the general range we're looking at. Awesome. Thank you very much, Ian. Absolutely. Once again, uh, we're here at the Henry's Photographic Video Dig Digital Imaging Show at the International Center in Mississauga.